Welcome to this small additional uh, tutorial around the new website because a lot of stuff has changed and we fixed some issues and there's still some small issues of course mostly regarding to speed but we're working on that really hard right now. Um, but this small tutorial is concerning the settings in your user profile and in your newsletter profile and I wanted to explain the difference between groups and forums a little bit more clearly now. Uh, we got some mentions from users that got newsletters twice or didn't get newsletters at all or they got, I don't know, too many messages. Know that everything is configurable at Alpha Audio and we don't send out any messages you agreed to. Um, it doesn't make any sense because every uh, email uh, costs us money. <laughs> Simple as that. So if we send out all the newsletters twice, it's twice as expensive to distribute all those emails and that doesn't make any sense. So we wanted to show you how you can configure your uh, settings in your user profile and in your newsletter profile so you can tailor all the messages to your tastes. If you log in and you go to account, you can manage your account right here. You can manage your profile, your courses, your newsletters, and uh, you can see all your notifications. So if we go to my new newsletters, you can choose the newsletters you want uh, and you can set your default language. If mine is Dutch, uh, but you can select English or Dutch. So we now attach the language to a specific newsletter in the back end. So if you choose Dutch, you will only get Dutch newsletters. That makes sense because by default, these are selected both uh, and it will be annoying if you get them twice. You get the English and the Dutch one. That is not very nice. So either way, if you select a language, you get only not one newsletter. You can of course select them uh, or deselect them if you want, click save and it will be fixed. But it's very important that you select your language to get the right newsletter in your own language. So please check it and fix it to your taste and it all will be set correctly. If you go to account, manage account and my profile, you will see that you can select, uh, that you can adjust all sorts of settings. This is your main page, but if you go to account settings, you can alter all the messages you want or don't want. You can set them in account settings right here and go to notifications and you will see that you can switch on and switch off all the notifications you want. I've switched them on all of them because I want to be up to date. But if you think it's really annoying to get all those emails, please deselect them and we won't bother you with all the messages uh, anymore. Uh, you can also set your avatar picture, your uh, profile pictures uh, right here. This is your avatar picture. That's the small photo right here. And you can set your profile cover right here. Select the file and upload it. And if you check out your profile, it will look a little bit like this. This is the cover photo and this is the avatar picture. If you want to edit all the info right there, you can go to profile settings and you can set all the user info right here, like your name, your surname, where you live. And in about me, you can tell a little story about yourself like this. And it will show up on the uh, profile. You can choose if you want to make it public or not. Uh, and you can even uh, make your whole profile private for anyone to view. No problem at all. Okay, that's about the messages, newsletters and stuff like that. Again, go to login, go to account, go to manage account. Profile stuff is right there. Newsletter stuff is right here. Then a little bit about groups and forums. With the restyle, we decided to create groups. Uh, groups are like 
segments within the hobby, uh, like uh, general hi-fi topics, music, streaming audio, stereo hi-fi, analog and vinyl, and mobile. We have the same groups in Dutch. Uh, the Dutch forum and groups are a little bit more active. Uh, that makes sense because the website is older and we had more users. But still, our goal is to create a, a fun community around our hobby. And we wanted to make it easier to share, yeah, you know, experiences, news, tweaks, and stuff like that. So that's why we created groups. Every group also has a forum. So if I click on streaming audio, for example, you will see that there are some posts, not a lot. We want it to be more, of course. <laughs> Um, but you can see that you can uh, ask a question on the front page. It's fine. But know that in the group, if it becomes more active, it will disappear pretty quickly. This is more like a Facebook page to share uh, some fun stuff. A photo, a video, uh, maybe a slideshow, of your, a slideshow of your new system or uh, anything you want. You can see here, you can share photos, slideshows, GIFs, videos, uh, a link to a stuff, or you can create a poll, anything you want. So that's the, uh, the, the group page. If you become a member, um, you will get notifications via email. You can disable them in your profile, like I said before. But there's also a forum. And what's the difference? Well, it's pretty simple, actually. The front page of the group is for sharing quick stuff. The forum is more for in-depth questions. So if you have a question regarding uh, how to set up a router or what the use of your switch is or where you could place the switch the best or what cable you should use or power supplies, you can create a forum topic. And that forum topic is much more static than the front page of the group. If a lot of people post on the front page, it will get to the bottom of the page very quickly. In a forum, people can search for topics and they will find your topic. That's the big difference between forum topics and group posts. I hope it's more clear right now and I hope you're gonna use it because the, our goal is, like I said, to create a community that is fun, that is informative and friendly, and it's just a place to be where you want to enjoy your hobby. I hope it makes it more clear, and I hope to see you soon. Thank you. Bye-bye.